Hi folks, good afternoon ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Carter Activity Center. We have a double header of action today for your pioneers as they host Macomb College. Lady Pioneers will play first at one and the men will follow shortly thereafter sometime around three o'clock. For Macomb University, the women, the Warriors come in with a record of three and 13. Starters for today's contest, number 11, Mackenzie Ackley, 14, Janae McIntosh, 21, Azrae Richard, 23, Jayla McIntosh, and 24, Malia Jacobs. They are coached by Tara Cooney Baker. For your Pioneers, they will roll out with number 10, Sierra Floyd, 22, Regiana Ward, 30, Brindley Morgan, 32, Travia Woodruff making her debut this season in the Carter Activity Center after a strong showing of 11 assists in her first action this season on the road against Arkansas Baptist. And number 43, Hunter Gibson. Pioneers are coached by Brad Phillips and assisted by Mike Milligan. About three and a half minutes away from tip-off. Pioneers come in. Lady, excuse me, the Lady Pioneers come in with a record today of 9-7, and becoming 3-13. and It's a conference game for both, con for both teams. About three and a half minutes away from game action. Stay tuned, and we'll have more here on the Curlers Ridge College channel on YouTube.
Warrior folks just about ready for the tip off. Warriors are in their black jerseys with white letters and red trim around the top. Lady Pioneers in their home grays with green numbers and green trimmy Hunter Gibson. Lady Pioneers are a little bit more thin today than normal with three to four players out with various injuries, but not as thin as the Warriors of the Combs, who have only dressed out eight for tonight's contest. Gibson will be jumping for the Pioneers. Ball is up, and Gibson wins the tip. He goes back to Sierra Ford, and Pioneers will have first possession. Trivia Woodward takes over, swings the ball over to Floyd on the right wing. Floyd looking for somewhere to go, drives inside, gives it out. Floyd thought about the three, drives it instead, dishes it to Gibson. Gibson back to Floyd. Floyd inside to Travia. Travia layup through traffic, no good. Defensive rebound to the cone. Lady Warriors race down for their first action. Three-point shot from the right wing on the way, hits the front of the rim. No good. Defensive rebound, Brindley Morgan. Morgan pitches it ahead to Woodruff. Woodruff drives and she is fouled on the baseline. Woodruff will inbound. She throws it to a cutting Gibson. Gibson misses the layup. Gets her own rebound off the glass and rattles home. Gibson with a McCone on their side of half court. Ball on the left wing. Swung around. McIntosh drives it from the top of the key. She'll attempt a shot from six feet. No good. Offensive rebound also no good. Defensive rebound to Ward. Ward waiting top of the key. Swings it around to Trevia Woodruff. She'll attempt a three. No good. Defensive rebound chased down by McComb. Jacobs has it. Loses the handle. Ball goes out of bounds. It will be... 8.36 left in the first quarter. Woodruff directing traffic. She'll get a double. Floyd swings it back to Woodruff. Hand off to Morgan. Morgan drives inside. Spin move. Kicks it back out. Woodruff goes inside to Gibson. Gibson turn around, jump in the lane. No good. And push it up in transition. Two-point shot from Richard is no good. Traced down by Morgan. Morgan was surrounded and ball got tipped out by the cone. CRC will retain possession. Woodruff hands off to Morgan. Morgan gets a ball screen. Swings around to Floyd. Floyd gets a ball screen. Swings it back to Morgan. Morgan throws it inside to Gibson at the high post. Gibson kicks it out to Ward. Three-point shot, right wing, no good. Defensive rebound to Richard. Richard skips it up the floor to McIntosh. McIntosh loses it, regains it, shoots it, and misses. Chases down her own rebound and skips it out. McIntosh, couple dribbles, skips it over. Three-point shot from Richard is no good. Defensive rebound to Ward. And Ward will push with pace. She'll pull it out. Swing it around to Gibson. Gibson skips it to Floyd. Three. Seven minutes left in the first quarter. Still 2 nothing Pioneers. Ball swung around. McIntosh on top of the key. Tries to throw it inside. Ball is tipped out by Travia Woodruff. It'll stay with Bacone. One shot has been made by either team. Bacone will take it out under their own basket. Richard will be the inbounder. Bacone lines up in a box. Pioneers switch to the zone. Ball skipped out. Drive comes. Turnover from Ackley. Stolen by Floyd. Morgan swings it over to Woodruff. She crosses the timeline. Good pass inside to Gibson. Jalen McIntosh. And Gibson will head to the line shooting two. Last time Gibson was at home, she made 13 of her 14 free throw attempts. First shot on the way. It's good. 3-0. Gibson in that contest tied a the program high for points in a game. 33. Gibson's two for two. She's got all four points. Lady Pioneers up 4 nothing. And intercepts and seals it. She'll push it up. Woodruff, baseline drive, layup. Off glass is good. Credit Morgan with the assist. Pioneers up 6 nothing, And because it's 6 nothing, 6.27 left in the first quarter. Seven left in the 
first quarter. McComb will inbound in front of their own bench. Leading scores for CRC, Hunter Gibson with four and Travia Woodruff with two. McCone has it on the right side. It'll be caught just outside the top of the key. It's no good. Hits the backboard twice. Top of the backboard twice. Don't go out of bounds to CRC. McCone switching up their pressure a little bit. They go to full court man. Able to beat her defender. Woodruff directing traffic. Skips it out. Floyd thought about the three. Drives it instead. Skips it out to Morgan. Morgan one more to Ward. Ward three-point shot. Top of the wing. No good. Floyd tried to chase it down, but she's unable to grab it before it goes out of bounds. McComb will take over. Bentley will run the offense for the Warriors. Ball goes inside to McIntosh. McIntosh working on Gibson. Skips it out. Bentley thought about the drive. Pulls it out. Swings it around. Ball goes to Cooney. It'll be driven and knocked out of bounds by Woodruff. McCone will have it under their own goal. There's six on the shot clock. Black Bear to take it out. She swings it around. Cooney on three on the shot clock. McCone looking for somewhere to go. Shot thrown up wildly. No good. Defensive rebound, Brindley Morgan. Morgan is surrounded and gives it up to Floyd, who gives it to Woodruff. And Travia will reset the CRC offense. She'll get a ball screen from Gibson. In and out crossover. Drive. Off glass. No good. Mentally pushing. McComb with a five on four. Ball goes to the corner. Swung back to the corner. Now inside. Turnaround shot from McIntosh is no good. Defensive rebound. Two. He has it. Thought about the three. Swings it to Woodruff. Now inside to Gibson. Ball being knocked out of bounds and will stay with CRC. A couple subs for you, Lady Pioneers, it looks like. Kayla Smith and Octavia Lowry will check in for Brinley Morgan and Regiana Ward. Lowry will take it out of bounds, 15 on the shot clock. Gibson, swing back to Woodruff. She swings it to Lowry. Lowry looking for somewhere to go, kicks it out. Woodruff, eight on the shot clock. She'll drive it, skip it out, corner three. Sierra Floyd, no good. And defensive rebound to Bentley. At the 420. Woodruff skips it out to Lowry. Lowry, three-point shot in transition is good. Octavia Lowry, first shot, first three, first points of the game. Credit Woodruff with the assist. CRC up 9-0. Redirecting traffic for the Warriors. Swings it around. McIntosh. Trying to throw it inside. Ball's tipped out and then stolen by Woodruff. Cooney. Her first, team's third. Bevy of subs for Bacone. As Ackley and Richard check in. Woodruff to inbound, throws. Sierra Foy, top of the key, inside to Hunter Gibson. Gibson working. Tries to spin, balls deflected out and stolen by Black Bear. Here comes Bacone in transition. 328 left in the first, CRC up 9 nothing. Woodruff working. Woodruff able to tip it, but it goes back to McCone. McCone racing in transition. Layup off glass. No good. They were able to get the offensive rebound. Two-point shot from Jacobs. Top of the key is good. And McCone, McCone still showing full court man. Lowry will walk it herself up the floor. Swings it to Gibson. Gibson three-point shot is good. Just outside the corner. Hunter Gibson gives the McCone in the half court. Ball swung around to the left wing. Thrown back to the top of the key. Ackley will drive it and turn it over and it's stolen by Floyd. Woodruff skips it out, skips it around to Gibson. Gibson will try another three. No good. Offense. It'll be an offensive rebound for Floyd and she was fouled. It's fourth. So one more and CRC will be in the double bonus. Jamaria Johnson checks in for Sierra Floyd. Lowry will inbound just in front of the bleachers. Ward directing traffic, throws it to Smith. Down to Gibson in the corner. Back to Lowry, Lowry will drive it. Kicks it back out, Gibson will attempt another three. No good. Defensive rebound to Richard. Richard running up the court, she'll take it herself. She pulls up from eight feet, no good. Lowry, Lowry thought about the three, drive instead. 
Dish it inside to Jamari Johnson. Johnson throws it out. A bounce for a turnover. McCone in the half court. Ackley on the left wing. Swings it around to Blackberry. She'll drive it and kick it. She gets a ball screen. Ball's trying to throw back to Blackberry, but Smith knocks it out of bounds. So McCone will take it out in front of the CRC bench. 16 on the shot clock. Ball's inbounded. Jacobs, three-point shot, top of the key, no good for the layup. She's got all four of McCone's points. 12-4 CRC. Lowry driving. Tries to pull it out. Loses the hand out to Gibson. Gibson will drive it this time. Euro step in the lane. Off glass and good. Good decision to drive from Gibson. 14-4 CRC just under. Layup in traffic by Ackley, and she is fouled. It's the first foul for CRC in the game. It'll be on Jamaria Johnson, her first team first. And Ackley will head to the line shooting two. 9.5 left in the quarter. CRC up by 10. Ackley at the line, a sophomore guard from Oneida, Wisconsin. First shot is good. Second shot on the way. No good. Defensive rebound to Johnson. Johnson throws it to Ward. Ward will direct the CRC offense. Was it in traffic? Euro step. No good, but she was fouled. Foul will be on Abigail Bentley, her first. For McCollum, that's their fifth foul, and CRC will shoot the double. Pioneer lead back to double digits at 10. Second shot on the way. No good. Defensive rebound to Blackbear. Bentley working on war. She tries to drive. Shot off glass. Tough shot is good. Wild shot, no good. Defensive rebound to Richard. Four on the clock. Richard tries to take it herself. Lowry pokes it out, and McCone will not get off a shot. And that will end the recap and second quarter action here shortly. Folks, CRC leads 15-7 after the first quarter. Stat recap, Hunter Gibson leads all scorers with nine points. She's followed by Octavia Lowry with three, Trevor Woodruff with two, Ray John Ward with one. For McCollum, they're led in scoring by Malia Jacobs with four. Abigail Bentley has two, and Mackenzie Ackley with one. McCollum in the first quarter shot 20% from the field. They did not make a three in four attempts and 75% of the free throw line. Largest lead was held by CRC at the three minutes of the second quarter. Richard on the right side, gets a ball screen, swings it back to the corner. Three-point shot from Bentley, no good, hits the top of the backboard and comes back to Richard. Richard able to kiss it in for the layup, 15-9. Cone still showing full court pressure. On the floor for CRC is Morgan, Lowry, Woodruff, Ward, and Jamaria Johnson. Woodruff calls for a ball screen. Lowry with a smooth shot from 15. She's got five. CRC up 17-9. Cone in the half court. Richard tries to drive on Lowry. She'll kick it out to White Bear. White Bear drives and swings it out. Three-point shot from Ackley is good. McCone, two for three to start the quarter. Cut the lead to 17-12. Woodruff on the drive. And turns it over. Richard dives on the floor, but she throws it to Lowry. So CRC will retain possession in their side of half court. Woodruff throws it inside to Johnson. Johnson working in the post. Right hand hook shot, no good. 
Defensive rebound to Ackland. Boss turned over. Woodruff picks it off. In and out crossover. Kick back to Johnson. 15 foot shot. No good. Offensive rebound chased down by Morgan. Morgan finds Lowry. Lowry shoots it from 12 and she connects. She's got seven points. Richard drives on Morgan, tries to post. Turn around, right hand hook shot, no good. Bone swats it out of bounds and it'll stay, go to CRC. Woodruff will walk it across. She gets a ball screen from Morgan to heads left. Breaks down her defender, skips it out to Lowry. But it's deflected out to Lowry. Lowry throws it to Ward. Ward tries to drive it, kicks it out to Woodruff. Woodruff drives, kicks it inside to her cutting. Ward, beautiful. Travia. Ball skipped out from Bacone. Three point shot left wing, no good. Hits the shot clock and goes out of bounds. 21 12 CRC. Gibson checks in for Jamaica. Woodruff jogs it up. Top of the key. Gets a ball screen from Gibson. She'll drive it in. Layup. Off glass is good. He pushes the lead up to 11. Ackley working top of the key. She'll swing it around to Bentley. Bentley skips it back over. Three point shot from Black Bear. Left wing. No good. Offensive rebound to Bacone. Another two point shot just inside the three point line from Jacobs is good. She's got six. Woodruff will jog it across. Play up, but Brindley Morgan was able to chase it down and knock it out of bounds before the shot. McComb will take over. Throw it inside. Shot blocked by Morgan, but offensive rebound back to McComb. And Ward will draw an offensive foul on Jacobs. So a good defensive position with the block. Ward with the charge. Cone still showing full court man. Lowry inbound. She throws it into Woodruff. Woodruff able to split a the cone racing back. Ball swung around. Two point shot from Bentley is no good. Gibson chases down the rebound. Gibson looking for a teammate. Throws, tries to throw it to Ward and the ball's to four. 23-14, 5.59 left in the half. Going to inbound. They throw it in the backcourt. And Bentley will walk it across. Pioneer still in the man to man. Bentley will just walk into a three at the top of the key and we and CRC letter. 23-17. The Cone leads 23-17. And we're back. CRC will inbound. Lowry throws it to Ward, and Ward will race it up in transition. She skips it out. Gibson, three points. 26 17 CRC. Gibson, her second three of the contest. Jacobs has it, top of the key. Thought about the shot. She'll step back on Gibson and hits a shot that rattles home off the front of the rim. She's got eight. Lowry to inbound. She throws it to Woodruff. The ball is deflected out of bounds by Bacone. CRC will retain possession. Ball is skipped out to Gibson. Gibson will walk into a 15-footer, and she will bury it. 
28-9. Mentally walks it across for the Warriors. The ball goes inside to Jacobs. Jacobs will turn around. Another 15-foot jumper. No good. This time defensive rebound to Ward. Gibson swings it back out to Lowry. Lowry kicks it back to Gibson. Gets a ball screen. Gibson finds a cutting Lowry off the pick and roll. And Lowry able to two-man game. Lowry able to finish with that right hand. And CRC up 30-19 with 4.41 left. But Cone uses its third timeout. We'll be back. Back to action. McCullough inbound in front of the CRC goal. 441 left. CRC up 30 to 19. Bentley will jog it across. CRC in a zone. Three point shot on the way is good by number 11, McKenzie Ackley. 30 22. Morgan throws it ahead to Gibson. Gibson will drive it inside. Gives it back out to Morgan. Swung around to Lowry. Three-point shot on the way. No good. Morgan able to chase down the offensive rebound. Throws up a shot, but it's no good. Defensive rebound to Jacobs. She'll try a drive. Scoop shot. No good. Offensive rebound to Jacobs. She throws up a shot. No good. Morgan able to chase down the defensive rebound. And find Lowry. Woodruff back inside to Lowry. Working one-on-one. Turnaround jumper. No good. Defensive rebound to Ackley. Ackley drives it in, kicks it out. Three-point shot on the way from Jacobs is good. 30-25. Coach Brad Phillips will take his first time out of the game. He will take a full timeout. 3.33 left, CRC up 30-25. back. On the floor for the Lady Pioneers is Floyd Woodruff, Ward, Gibson, and Morgan. Woodruff swings around to Ward. Ward, top of the key. She'll drive it inside. Shots a shot in traffic. It's no good. Going to go out of bounds to the, at the 310 mark. Bentley swings it around to Cooney. Cooney gets a ball screen. Rejects it. Hands it back off to Bentley. Bentley will attempt a three in the right corner and bury it. 30-28. CRC lead cut down to two. Lady Warriors have not led in this contest. This is the closest they've been since the beginning. Ward throws it inside to Gibson. Gibson working the 15 foot mark. She'll turn around and jump. Jump her outside the free throw line. Snow Woodruff able to run it down and steal it. Lady Pioneers with numbers. Three on two. Three point shot. Brindley Morgan. Corner is good. Credit Woodruff for the assist. That's a stoppage in action. Looks like Woodruff was down. She's helped her feet by Ward and she'll walk it off. So for the Lady Pioneers, 227 left, Pioneers up by five. Bentley jogs it across the half court line, swings it around to Ackley. Mac Boyd both hit the deck, but McCollum will retain possession under their own basket, 16 on the shot clock. Oh, the refs get together and they will give it back to CRC instead, saying Bacone touched it last. So Floyd will inbound. Bacone's still in the full court pressure, man to man. Morgan has it. She'll clear out traffic. Morgan jogging it across. 
Drives on Bentley. Picks up her dribble. Skips it out to Floyd. Floyd swings it around to Smith. Back to Morgan. Morgan, baseline drive. Pull up jumper. 10 foot, no good. Defensive rebound to McIntosh. And she'll run it up the floor. She skips it out. Drive from McCullough. Off glass, no good. Offensive rebound. Goes to Ackley and she sticks it back in 33-30. Smith. Looking for somewhere to go. Throws it to Morgan. Morgan circles it out. He is good. Credit for over the assist. Big shot from Michaela Smith. Her first points of the game. Pushes the Pioneer lead up to six. 115 left in the half. Ackley working on Smith. She'll drive it in. And they will call Smith for the foul. Light contact there from Smith. Oh, excuse me. They'll call Floyd with the foul. So for Sierra Floyd, that's her first, team's first. Ball swung around. McCollum, three-point shot. In the corner is good from Abigail Bentley. Lead cut down to three, 53 seconds. We'll drop it and kick it out to Floyd. Floyd, shot fake, 15-foot shot, no good. Bentley with a defensive rebound, 37 seconds left. Warriors in the half court. Shot clock and game clock separated by about 10 seconds. McIntosh working on Morgan. Swings it around to Ackley. Ackley working on Smith. She'll drive it. Tries a shot in traffic and she is fouled. And she will head the line for two. Fouls on number 23, Michaela Smith. Her first team's second. And Ackley at the line. 17.2 left on the clock. First free throw on the way is good. Second shot. Is good. 36-35. Floyd inbound, throws it to Morgan. Skips it out to Ward. Ward traveled on the drive. So McCone will take over in front of their own bench. 36-35, nine points on the drive. She loses the handle. Actually, it's knocked out by Ward, but McComb will retain possession. 4.2 on the clock. McIntosh to inbound. Throws it inside. Balls deflected out. Smith with the steal. Gibson will try a half-court heave at the buzzer, but it's no good. We wouldn't have counted anyway. It was late. So CRC holds a 36-35 advantage at the end of the first half. Kind of a sloppy period for both teams. We'll have stats and recap here shortly. First half recap, Pioneers lead 36-35 at the end of the first half. Scoring Octavia Lowry with nine, Trevor Woodruff with four, Regina Ward, Brindley Morgan, and Michaela Smith all with three. Pioneers in the first half shot 38%. They have three players with 11, Mackenzie Ackley, Malia Jacobs, and Abigail Bentley. Rounding out their scoring, it shot 34%, 43% from deep, and 75% of the free throw line. Scoring by period, CRC held a 15-7 advantage. Years. And that's how we get our 36-35 advantage. Cone still has not held a lead in this game, while CRC's largest lead was 11 at the 7.09 mark in the second quarter. Still got about 12 Ortley.
start the second half, they walk out with Reggie Allen Ward, Brinley Morgan, Sierra Floyd, Hunter Gibson, and Michael Smith. CRC will inbound in front of the home bleachers. They will have first possession. Floyd to inbound. She throws in the backcourt to Ward, and we are ready for the third quarter. Cohen in the man-to-man. -man. Ward working off a double ball screen. Hands it off to Smith. Swung around to Gibson. Back to Morgan on the left wing. Morgan, foot fake drive. Loses it out of bounds, and it'll be turned over to the Warriors. McIntosh walks it across, but Cohen looking for their first lead of the game. She'll drive it, kick it out. Ball swung around to Jacobs. Jacobs drive in traffic, left hand off glass, no good. Loose ball will be knocked out of bounds by Floyd and Bacone will have an offensive rebound. Bacone had 10 offensive rebounds in the first half, now they've got 11 for the game. Ball is inbounded quickly to McIntosh and she kisses it off the glass. And just like that, Bacone claims the lead, 37-36. It's her first lead of the contest. Ward working, hands it off to Smith. Smith, three-pointer off the screen, air ball, no good. Defensive rebound to Jacobs. McIntosh jogs it across, swings it down. Shot from the short corners, no good. Another air ball rebounded by Smith. So McComb will take over, inbounding on their side of the floor. Fresh shot clock. Ball's thrown into McIntosh. Thought about the three. She'll swing it around to Jacobs. Jacobs, spin move, right hand in traffic, no good. Defensive rebound to Brimley Morgan. Morgan, she attempted the layup. Let's see who that foul is on. Foul will be on 14. Janaya McIntosh, her first. And to the line shooting twos, Reggie Allen Ward. Ward in the first half had three points. First free throw is good, 37 all. Second shot from Ward incoming, no good. And Ward will be for Ward, that is her first foul, team's first of the third quarter. McIntosh will jog it across for the Warriors. Tied at 37. Throws it in, and then Ward commits the foul. So for Ward, that'll be her second, team second, and Jacobs will hit the line shooting two. Jacobs listed as a 5'6 guard. Sophomore at the line. First free throw is good. Second free throw on the way. Also good. 39-37 Warriors. Warriors will set up the offense. She gets a double ball screen and heads right. Hand off to Morgan. Swung around to Gibson. Gibson thought about the three. Drives it instead. Kicks it out to Ward. Ward baseline drive. Kick out to Smith. Smith three-point shot on the way. Left wing. Back of the rim. No good. Cone pushes the ball up in a hurry. Ackley drives it, kicks it out to Jacobs. Jacobs thought about the 15-footer, drives, cuts off by Gibson, skips it out. McIntosh swings it around. Richard, 15-foot shot, no good. Defensive rebound to Brindley Morgan. Morgan able to save it and swing it to Ward. Ward pushing in transit. And Smith swings it back out to Ward. Ward drives. Euro in traffic is good. Ward able to scoop that through two defenders and tie it. McIntosh swings it inside. She'll drive it. She's tied up by Morgan, and Morgan eventually pulls it away. Morgan crossover, drives it out, kicks it out to Foy. Foy drives it and kicks it back out to Morgan. Three-point shot in the corner, no good. Defensive rebound to McIntosh. And Jayla McIntosh pulls it from 15 feet to give Bacone the lead, 41-39. Morgan swings it to Reggie Allen Ward. Good finish from Hunter Gibson, ties the game at 41.
Jalen McIntosh hands it off. Richard drives on Ward. Shot off glass. No good. Defensive rebound to Hunter Gibson. Gibson pushing the ball herself up the floor. She kicks it out. Floyd, three-point shot in transition. No good. Defensive rebound to Jacobs. Ackley, Ackley drives and turns it over. Smith with a steal, and she is fouled immediately. Foul will be on Mackenzie Ackley, her first, McCone's second. Octavia Lowry checks in for Sierra Floyd. And for McCone, Tara Blackberry checks in for Azare Richard. And a half left. Smith swings it around to Morgan. Back to Lowry. Lowry inside to Gibson. Gibson, post move, and she is, they say it'll be a jump ball. It'll be a turnover on the Lady Pioneers. McIntosh jogs it up the floor. She's guarded by Lowry. Pioneers in the man-to-man. Hands it off. Ackley swings it around to Jacobs. Jacobs trying to drive on Gibson. Left-hand shot. Up and under. Scoop move. No good. Defensive rebound to Brindley Morgan. And she goes out of bounds to save it, but it's brought back by McCone. They get an offensive rebound. Shot from McIntosh. Shot the key. No good. Defensive rebound to Lowry. Lowry pushes it in transition to Smith. Three-point shot in transition. No good. McCone with the defensive rebound. McIntosh will jog it up on Ward. She's in touch. Ward with a defensive rebound. Ward swings it around to Gibson. Gibson will attempt a three-point shot. No good. Defensive rebound to Jacobs. Jacobs tried to tie it up by Morgan. Skips it out to McIntosh. McIntosh working on Ward. 15-foot jumper is good. 43-41. Ward slowly walk, working it up for CRC. Conan man-to-man. Morgan, top of the key, drives it. Tries to force it inside. Lowry chases it down. Lowry pulls up from 15 feet and buries it in the cor short corner. Octavia Lowry once again providing a spark off the bench offensively for CRC. She's in double digits with 11. McIntosh inside, working, finds a cutting Blackbear who scores it in the lane from six feet with a floater. Cullen reclaims the lead, 45-43. Ward swings it around to Morgan, back to Lowry. Lowry working on the left wing. She'll get a ball screen, she'll reject. Spin move, turn around jumper, 15 feet, no good. Defensive rebound to McComb. Ackley swings it around. McIntosh throws it around to the left wing to Ackley. Ackley throws it to the left corner. Shot, no good. Defensive rebound, or excuse me, offensive rebound to McIntosh, and she will get her offensive rebound and stick it back in. Cone leads by four. And Coach Brad Phillips will take a timeout. It'll be a 37 left. Trail by 4, 47-43. Sierra Foy just checked into the game, throws it to Ward, and she'll walk it up. Cone in the man-to-man. -man. Ward swings around to Morgan, left wing. Back to Lowry, top of the key. Three-point shot, Lowry, no good. Defensive rebound to Bentley. Bentley swings it down to McIntosh. And we have an administrative timeout as the shot clock didn't start. The Cone will still retain possession. They'll take it out in front of the scores table. Two thirty-three left. Ball swung back in. 
McIntosh working on Ward. Looking inside, throws it inside to Jacobs. Jacobs just outside the free throw line. Throws it inside, but the ball's deflected and stolen by Reggie on Ward. Ward pushing in transition. Kicks it down to Gibson, her teammate, and Gibson kisses. McCone on the half court. Cooney hands it off to Black Bear. Black Bear swings it back to Bentley. Now it's with McIntosh. Now Bentley, short shot, three-point shot. Front of the rim, no good. Defensive rebound to Ford. 140 left. Morgan swings it down to Lowry. Lowry stares down. A wide open three in and out. Offensive rebound, Sierra Floyd. Back to Lowry. She finds Morgan. Morgan has a wide open three. And she buries it in the corner. Big possession for the Lady Pioneers as they reclaim the lead. Warriors now in the half court. White Bear working on Morgan. She'll try to drive. She picks it up, skips it out. Three-point shot, Bentley, right corner, no good. Offensive rebound, back to Black Bear, and she finds a wide-open McIntosh who kicks it off the glass from the block and makes it. McCone reclaims the lead, 49-48. Gibson drives it inside. Layup off glass is good. Black Bear almost turns it over. Bentley chases it down. Bentley working on Lowry, swings it back to McIntosh. Now inside to Jacobs. Jacobs driving on Gibson. She is fouled. For Gibson, that is her first foul of the game. Third on the Lady Pioneers. And to the line shooting two is number 24, Malia Jacobs. 50 winds and fires. It's good. Tied up at 50. 25.9 here left in the third quarter. Jacobs' second free throw is on the way. It's good. McCone reclaims the lead, 51-50. Ward will walk it up. Shot clock is turned off. Under 22 seconds left. Coach Phillips calling out a play. Ward drives it inside. Scoop shot off glass, no good. Gibson, offensive rebound, stick back is good. 51-50. McCone racing up in transition. Cooney. Hands it off. Blackberry back to Bentley. One second left. Shot. A 52-51 edge at the end of the third quarter. Ten minutes left of action. We'll bring you a stat recap here shortly. Quick stat recap here for your Lady Pioneers. They're led scoring by Hunter Gibson. She's got 22. Octavia Lowry has 11. John Ward and Billy Morgan with six. This quarter, they hold a one point 52-51 edge. Sierra Floyd will take it out in front of the home bleachers. On the floor for your Lady Pioneers, Lowry, Gibson, Morgan, Floyd, and Ward. Floyd inbounds it to Gibson. Gibson drives it inside. Left hand shot. No good, but she was fouled. So Gibson will hit the line shooting two. Fouls on 24. Malia Jacobs, her third. Gibson at the line. Two for two on the day. First free throw on the way is good. Gibson now with 23. 53-51. Second free throw from Gibson is good. Pioneers with a three-point advantage. Gibson with 24. Ball swung up quickly. Skipped around. Jacobs, three-point shot. Top of the key is good. And just like that, we're tied at 54. 
Floyd inbounds to Lowry. Lowry skips it around to Ward. Ward working in the half court. Swings it around to Morgan. Morgan back to Lowry. Top the key. Lowry inside to Gibson. Gibson drives. Kicks it out to Morgan. Morgan skip pass to Ward. Ward will drive it. And it'll go off her foot out of bounds. Turnover. Suffer Bacone is... Janae McIntosh will check in for Malia Jacobs. Spicone so goes small with five guards on the floor. Cooney hands it off to McIntosh. McIntosh working top of the key on floor. Pioneers pushing. Gibson swings it down to Lowry. The ball's deflected out of bounds. It'll stay with CRC. Lowry inbounds on her side of the floor. Throws it into Ward. Coach Phillips will organize the offense. Ward throws it inside to Floyd. Floyd looking for somewhere to go. Swings it back to Ward. Ward will drive it out. Kick it out to Floyd. Floyd throws it back inside to Ward. Ward tries a shot, but it's blocked. Defense will rebound to Bacone. McIntosh driving. Kicks it out. Three-point shot. Bentley on the way is good. And McCone leads 57-54. Lowry will jog it up. She'll pitch it back to Morgan. Morgan walks into a three. In and out, no good. Defense will rebound to Cooney. Bentley will walk it across. Swinging around to McIntosh. McIntosh swings it back. Three-point shot on the way from Jayla McIntosh is good. And McCone now has his largest leaning. Coach Brad Phillips will take a timeout. It'll be a full timeout. And we're back. Ward swings it around to Morgan in the corner. Morgan tr throws it inside to Floyd. Floyd's immediately double teamed, and she is fouled. See the fouls on. The fouls on 14. Janae McIntosh, her second. Second on the Warriors. Ward to inbound. Looking for somewhere to go. Gives it to Lowry. Lowry working in the short corner. Kicks it out to Floyd. Floyd, three point shot. Top of the key is good. Big shot from Floyd, cuts the lead down to three, 60-57. Three-point shot, McIntosh on the way, no good. Defensive rebound, Lowry. Pioneers racing in transition, they have numbers. Lowry, layup, off glass. Finish there from Lowry in traffic. Black Bear swings it around. Cooney swings it back to Bentley. Bentley hands it off to McIntosh. McIntosh, top of the key. Drives it in, kicks it out. She'll get it back. And she is fouled by Gibson, who tried to get a steal coming off the ball screen. And Gibson, that's her second. Bentley in the half court, 16 on the shot clock. Bentley looking for somewhere to go. Working on board. She'll drive it. Kick it out. 
Five on the shot clock. It's top of the key. McIntosh working on four. She'll have to shoot it. Three-point shot is no good. Defensive rebound to Ward. Pioneers with numbers in transition. Five on four. Ward drives it. Kicks it good. Gibson able to corral the offensive rebound and is stripped. McCall with numbers in transition. Cooney, transition layup. No good. Ward now pushing in transition. Pioneers with numbers. Ward, Euro step. Left side, good. Regiana Ward gives the lead back to CRC 61 60. After trailing by six, has reclaimed the lead on a 7 0 run. McCone in the half court. Ball swung around. McIntosh, top of the key, finds a cutting. Black Bear, who misses a shot in the lane. Lowry with the rebound. Lowry skips it ahead to Floyd. Floyd looking for somewhere to go. Swings it back to Ward. It's a rebound to Black Bear. And they will slow up the pace. Just under five remaining in the game. CRC up 61-60. Bentley throws it to McIntosh instead. McIntosh around the horn to Cooney. Cooney to Black Bear. Black Bear throws it inside. McIntosh kicks it out. Shot. As the shot clock expires by McIntosh, and it's good. 62-61. McIntosh had a tough contested jumper from 15 feet to give the Warriors the lead. Brindley Morgan working. Spin move. Nice move in the lane. Kisses it off the glass and good. Nice move there from Brindley Morgan. She gives CRC the lead, and Coach Phillips will take a timeout. 63-62, CRC, 420 left in the game. McComb will inbound. They trail 63-62. Bentley jogs it up the floor. Pioneers in the man to man. As Richard threw it out of bounds, teammate was not paying attention. Floyd will inbound. She finds Morgan. And work off of it. Skips it out to Floyd. Floyd looking for somewhere to go. Throws it inside to Lowry, who's posting. Turnaround jumper from Lowry in the lane off the back of the rim. Bentley swings it around to Richard. Richard skips it out to Black Bear. Back to Bentley. She'll hand it off. Ball swung around. Ackley thought about the three. She'll throw it inside instead to Jacobs. Jacobs tries to spin, throws it back. Richard, two-point shot, no good. Offensive rebound to Black Bear, and she sticks it in to get Bacone the lead. 64-63. Morgan runs it up in transition. Throws it back out to Ward. Drives it inside. In traffic. And finishes off glass. Good spin move there from Ward to reclaim the lead. 65-64. Three cone in the half court. Ball swung around. Richard has it on the left side. Skips it out to Jacobs. Jacobs will drive. Kicks it back out to Richard. Three-point shot on the way is no good. Ball will be deflected out of bounds. They'll go to CRC. There's an injury on the floors. Sierra Floyd is down. Kayla Smith will check in the game. We'll take a short break with the injury and come back shortly.
back. CRC leads 65-64, 2.43 left in the fourth quarter. Floyd is helped off by the trainer and assistant coach Mike Milligan. Lady Pioneers are already thin at guard with injuries. Ward and Lowry. Ward will have it for CRC. She'll walk it across. 2.36 left. Pioneers with a one-point lead. Ward drives it inside. Tries to kick it out. Smith unable to corral it. Turnover. Ball back to Bacon. Been off screen. Tries to drive it back, and she is fouled. Fouls on 44, Octavia Lowry. Bentley will inbound. Swung around. Richard throws it back to Bentley. Three-point shot in the corner. No good. Defensive rebound to Hunter Gibson. Slow up the offense. Under two remainings. Lady Pioneers with a one-point lead. Lowry rejects the ball screen, drives it herself. Scoop layup in traffic, no good. Lowry offensive rebound, and she is fouled. So Lowry will head the line, and she'll shoot two. Foul will be on 11, McKenzie Ackley. And Lowry will head to the free throw line for her first two free throws. at the line, 153 remaining. First free throw on the way. No good. Second free throw incoming. It's good. 66-64. CRC. McCone jogs it up, swings it around to Jacobs. Jacobs to Ackley. Ackley back to McIntosh. She'll kick it out. Three-point shot. Bentley on the way. No good. Lowry gets the defensive rebound, and she is off to the races. And she was Morgan on the side. She drives it. Kicks it back to Lowry. Lowry rejects the ball screen. Tries to throw behind her back. Ball's loose on the floor, and it will be tied up. And they'll go to Bacone. Turnover on the Lady Pioneers. One fifteen left, but going on their side of half court. Ackley drives it, kicks it out to Bentley. Bentley throws it back to Ackley. Ackley drives it, kicks it out to McIntosh. McIntosh swings it back. Ackley with it. She'll drive on Lowry, and she will be fouled. So Ackley will hit the line shooting two. Let's see who the foul's on. It'll be on Lowry. It's her second. Ackley at the line denies three for four from the free throw line. First shot on the way. It's good. 66-65, 58.4 left in the contest. Second free throw on the way. It's good. Tie ball game, 66 all. Under a minute left. Lowry. Gets it and throws it to Morgan. Cohen still showing full court man. Brindley Morgan drives, tries to throw it down to Gibson and turns it over. Timeout. We will too and be back in 30 seconds.
back. McComb will inbound on their side of the court. We're tied up 66-66, 50.5 seconds remaining. You're just now tuning into the stream. You're going to catch an exciting final minute of action. Cone to inbound. Bentley has it. She's working on Morgan. McIntosh, left wing. McIntosh, looking for somewhere to go. Tries to throw it inside. Smith with a flex it. Ball is loose. Ball is stolen. It looked like really Morgan had possession, but they're going to call jump ball. It'll go to CRC regardless. And Morgan is down for the moment. CRC will regain possession. There's 29.5 seconds left on the shot, on the game clock, excuse me. We will take a brief break. Morgan's able to walk away under her own power. CRC will take possession on the sideline out of bounds in front of the home bleachers. 29.5 left in the contest. Jamaria Johnson will check in for Morgan. So on the floor for CRC, Ward, Smith, Lowry, Gibson, and Jamaria Johnson. Smith will take it out. CRC lines up in a stack. Pausing the game actions, they get ready. We're ready now. Smith to inbound. She throws it to Lowry. They clear everybody. Eschen. Lowry crossover, and she is fouled immediately. She's able to break down her defender, and McIntosh fouled her for third personal. Another thing to watch that is McCone's fourth foul of the quarter. One more, and CRC will shoot the double bonus. Smith to inbound. 19.2 left. She throws it into Gibson. Gibson circles it out. Ref stops the game saying the clock never ran. Still 66-66. Smith to inbound again. She hands it off to Ward. Ward drives it in traffic. And she is fouled. And she so Ward heading to the line for two. 15 seconds left. Ward at the line. First free throw is good, 67-66. Second free throw, no good. Defensive rebound to McComb. Under 12, they race it up to four. Ball's handed off. Bentley, seven seconds. Swung around. Drive from Jacobs in traffic. Off glass, in and out, no good. They get the offensive rebound, kick it out, and that'll end. And that will do it off the offensive rebound. So CRC will escape with a 67-66 victory to improve to 10-7 this year. Pioneers double digits in the win column with their 10th win. McCone drops to 3-14. We'll have final stats and a recap here shortly.
All right, folks, final recap here. CRC wins 67-66 over Pecone to improve to 10-7 this year. Leading scorer in the contest was Hunter Gibson. She had 24 points and 8 rebounds. Rounding out double-digit scoring was Octavia Lowry, who finished with 14 points, 5 rebounds, and 4 assists. Regina Ward also added 11, including the game-winning free throw with 15 seconds left in the contest. She also added 7 rebounds and 3 assists. CRC for the game shot 40%, 27% from 3, and 67% from the free throw line. For Bacone, they were led in scoring by Malia Jacobs, 18. Abigail Bentley had 14 off the bench. Kinsey Ackley had 13 from the field, 35% from 3, and 90% from the free throw line. Largest lead, Bacone held a six-point advantage at the 7.59 mark of the fourth quarter, and CRC held an 11-point lead at the second quarter at 7.09. Rebounding, Bacone actually out-rebounded CRC 48-34. The turnover battle was 15-14, advantage CRC. Again, CRC improving to 10-7 this season with a 67-66 win over the Warriors. The men's game is about 25 minutes away from action, so make sure you stay tuned as we round out our doubleheader. All right, folks, we're back. Joined by head coach Brad Phillips. As Lady Pioneers improved to 10 and 7 this season with a 67-66 victory over the Warriors of Bacon University. Coach, just kind of talk about this game. It was kind of a grind all the way through. You were able to fight adversity all the way. Yeah, I'm really proud of uh, you know how we fought through it and you know got a conference win and um, just uh, you know they they didn't quit and kept battling and. Um, you know, we're a little bit banged up. This has been a tough week for for our program, just to traveling and uh, we got some got some serious injuries. So we're just going to fight through it, and get some rest, and then we make the trip to Florida you know, this weekend. Coach, talk a little bit more about that. You've had not just one, not two, but four players go down with injuries here lately. Just talk about, you know, the overall state of your team with the girls that you do have and how they've been able to fight through this and show a little bit of toughness in this victory. Yeah, it was just it was really quick, actually. Uh, I mean, we were pretty healthy about a week ago, and then, you know, we got Trey back, and then she, she goes down here, and, you know, she's kind of our leader, our floor general, and... Hopefully she's going to be okay. Then Sierra Floor goes down, and uh, then we, we were out with Lindsey Browning, and uh, then we had two other ones in the JV that were playing some varsity. They're going to be out. So, yeah, we've just got to fight through the adversity and do the best we can. Coach, any wins, especially now January and February, making that grind in March, these are crucial conference wins. This is now a good little stretch that you're on. Talk about reaching double digits this year in victories and what's more to come. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I'm very happy that we're 10-7 and, seven and uh, um, you know, we've got us. So, you know, big test. And then, then it gets even tougher. Uh, we come back on that Tuesday, play high school, and then we got Iowa Wesleyan, so the top two teams in our conference. So this is fixing to be a brutal, brutal uh, 
a couple weeks for us. All right, perfect. Thanks, Coach. Lady Pioneers win 67-66 and improved to 10-7 overall. Make sure you stay tuned for the